Hi, this is Mike Callahan, Dr. FileFinder, and welcome to your Butterscotch.com tutorial on finding your Windows workgroup name. Now I'm here on a website that's talking about general concepts in naming workgroups. Your workgroup is part of networking and its name is assigned during installation. So if you bought your computer new, it more than likely has the default workgroup name of either workgroup or MS Home. Here they suggest that a workgroup not have more than 15 characters in the name, no spaces, and that to have fewer problems you should make sure that all the computers in your network are in the same work group. Now to find your work group, you can do it a couple different ways. Right click on my computer icon, click properties. When it comes up, click on the computer name tab. Here you see your computer's name and its work group. Here it's Calinet. If you want to rename the computer or change the work group, you click change. Here's where you change the computer's name. Here's where you change the work group. Now if you change the work group, you click OK. Be welcome to the new work group and be informed that you have to reboot. So this is one place to find your computer's work group name. Another place is to click on network places. And when that opens up, go down here to click view work group computers and when it does that it shows you the work group name right there so that's finding your windows work group name and that's all there is to it